What the hell? What was that? I don't know, Ted. Lights? Tricks? Yeah, I guess. I'm getting too old for this. Thing. This thing. Yeah, sounds right. Not really. Hey guys, Charizard694 here, and I did not realize when I went to walk at that room that that thing would show up. That was a little creepy, and I was like, oh gosh. <laughs> but anyway, welcome back to another Let's Play of Bear With Me. We left off last in the study, and we walked at, back into the east hallway, and as you saw, that creepy whatever that was scene came up of someone in the corner and writing on the wall, and it was red, so that, that's a little creepy. But yes, we found the torch, and now we're going to go ask Rusty if we can borrow one of his batteries so we can torch for whatever reason. But yeah. Rust, we need a big favor. What's this about, Bear? Rusty, we need a battery for our flashlight. We thought you could help us out. Sure, I got batteries, but here's the problem, miss. If I give you a battery, I gotta shut down for the rest of the night, and I have to keep an eye out. We could take some of that edge off, Rust. Why don't you rest your eyes for a bit and let me and the doll here take over? You? <laughs> no offense, Bear. I respect you as much as anyone in Paper City, but this here is different. I don't think you could handle this red guy on your own. You should take care of Miss Amelia. Leave the patrol to me. Are you saying I'm not qualified for watch duty? We have to wrap this thing up, fast. There's a bottle of carrot juice in my desk that's longing for my return. Carrot juice? We can keep an eye out for anyone suspicious in the meantime. Besides, you know I'm more than qualified. That nasty business from a couple of years ago, with them robots going missing. I was the one that brought that whole shady affair down and you know it. Are you trying to play me, Bear? I know you had nothing to do with that. That thing went so high up, there's no chance in hell Snoop like you even got close to wrapping it up. You seem to have blown a fuse there, Rust. It was me who cracked that case, and I can prove it. I have the case file and the credentials, handed to me by the commissioner in my office somewhere. Okay, okay, settle down there, Bear. Let's make a deal. You show me the credentials, and I'll hand over the battery. It's not that I don't believe you. I just want to make sure you're not playing me, is all. Can't you give us just one battery, Rusty? You'll still have a couple of them left, right? Here's the thing, little miss. It's a closed circuit. She knows. She's just playing on your soft side, Rust. Ted and Amber, move away. Oh my god, Ted. You're not supposed to read the brackets. Are you over? <laughs> Keep it rolling! We should get to my office, doll. There's an old file I have to find. What's this whole deal about anyways? Why can't he just give us a battery? We can keep an eye out. Rust is having a hard time coping with what happened. He worked in that mill for over 20 years, and now suddenly he's got nothing to do. Let's just do this to humor him. Poor Rust. Okay, you're right. Let's find that file. I think by the time this is over, we're going to meet a lot of people in his position. Oh, I love how they add in the little outtakes there. There should be an old file here somewhere. Nasty business from a couple of years ago. The robot union hired me to look into several cases of robot kidnappings. I remember. That CEO of Illuminarium, Skinner, used robot parts to manufacture headlights at low prices. Yep, I brought down that whole shady deal. Almost got shot in the process. Rust finds me unqualified for lookout duty. Probably thinks I'm a burnout. You're not a burnout, Ted. I mean, you were more driven before, but I understand you've had a lot on your mind lately. Anyways, I'm really glad you're with me on this one. Sure thing, doll. What am I going to say no to you? Thanks, Ted. Don't mention it, partner. Ooh, partner. All right, let's look into the file cabinet. Find it. There. Is this it? Yep, that's the one. Let's head back to that hothead robot. Alrighty, righty. We have the credentials. Got a battery. There you go, buddy. Signed and authorized by Commissioner Locke himself. Anyways, we really need that battery now, Rust. Time's a factor here. So it was you. I'll be damned. That was a big deal for us robots, you know? I always held you in high regard, Bear. But you just earned my utmost admiration, let me tell you. You can have my battery. I can use a little shut-eye, to be honest. Keep an eye out, and keep little miss here safe. 
Oh, and check on Millie from time to time. Make sure she's all right. Thanks, Rust. We won't let you down. Thank you so much, Rusty. Get some sleep. We'll wake you up in the morning. Okay, so, yes, we have the battery. Hey, I got it working. Oh, that's right. We went into the bathroom before and it was dark. Oh, oh, she's already gone. <laughs> oh, this is cool. Alright, so we've got a lot of stuff in here again we can click on. Let's just get right into it. You should really know what this is by now, buddy. It's where I take long showers and contemplate life. Also, I sing. Don't we all, Amber? Don't we all? It's full of bathroom stuff. Nah. Lots of creams and powders, also hair gel, a sponge thingy, some kind of paste and so on. Intended to make you look presentable when applying for a low-income 9-to-5 position to grind away the days. I don't really know what all that means. I picked it up in a movie once. <laughs> a waterfall. I feel like a lot of these are waterfall things. Maybe in our world, a happy little bush lives there. Just sitting there between light and dark shades of blue. Cascading waterfalls. A painting of something or another. It's too small to tell. Submerged ruins of an ancient temple. Fun fact, if you stuff a bunch of them down the toilet and flush, the water will overflow and the repair guy will come to fix it. Also complain about the economy and how he has to work on Sundays. <laughs> Just some stuff I don't really care about. It's full of bathroom stuff. A painting on the floor. Trying to get out of town, eh? You owe money to the art community. Listen here, man. I'll cut you a deal. I'll take on your debt and pay those money-grubbing watercolor pushers. Maybe I'll call you on your debt sometime. Maybe not. What do you say? Beats living on the run. Classic TP found in most bathrooms. What's there left to say that hasn't been published in Science Weekly already? Am I right? That is a huge toilet. Where's the money, Lebowski? I'm not going through trash. It's just my work ethic. Used to clean around the house. No, but nice try, Mom. <laughs> I'm not going through trash. This duster may come in handy. I'll take it with me just in case. It's full of uninteresting stuff. Mirror, mirror on the wall. Who will be a beautiful princess who's bound to live a long and happy life in a castle somewhere in France and have lots of ponies? Um, you are Amber, like for totes. I knew it. Did that thing just talk? I don't know. Did it? <laughs> um, you are Amber. <laughs> Pairs of towels just hanging out. All right, I think I've clicked on everything. Let's get out of the bathroom. It's a little creepy in here. What's happening? It's a what giant is this? eyeball! Doll, you seeing this? I, I, I don't know, Ted. What was that? It's fine. It's nothing, probably. It's the middle of the night, and the light is playing tricks on us. Let's go. Alright, guys. We are back again in the East Hallway. I'm going to leave today's Let's Play there, as I get out that we need the duster for the hole in the wall. And if we go do that, I reckon that will go into another lengthy conversation um, between Amber and Ed or something, or they'll discover something on the other side and that will might lead into a longer conversation again or something else or not. But I'm going to leave it there for today. Anyway, we um, got creeped out twice today, twice. The first part with the person sitting in the corner and then just then with in the bathroom with a big eyeball underneath <laughs> I'm a bit creeped out but <laughs> anyway guys I hope you're enjoying this let's play of bear with me so far smash that like button if you are and definitely want to see more I definitely want to play more and as always guys I thank you for watching and remember to keep on gaming bye